The passengers are currently boarding the Titanic and we are getting ready to finally set sail. Welcome everyone to the box for Titanic. Today is a beautiful day because today we are to set sail across the sea in the largest box fort we have ever built to sail. But before we sail in this magnificent box fort, perhaps you might be interested in checking out even cooler ships because this video is sponsored by World of Warships. Guys, this video is sponsored by World of Warships. World of Warships is a free game available for PC. It's a crazy action-packed game where you get to control ships and have an all-out battle on the sea. You can even play with your friends. It's all about tactics and skill. You can play with over 400 historical ships that you can control in various beautiful maps, all with unique living landscapes. I mean, just look at these graphics. It looks unreal. Plus the fact that there's realistic weather that changes the way you battle. You can even customize your ship and make it exactly how you would like it. There are four different types of warships to choose from. Destroyers, battleships, cruisers, and of course, aircraft carriers. My favorite is the battleship. It's got the thickest armor and biggest guns. You can survive a huge amount of damage and obliterate the enemies. Join over 44 million players and download World of Warships using the link in the description down below. If you use our link and the promo code BOOM, that's right, it's promo code BOOM, you get 200 doubloons, two ships, including the St. Louis and premium ship Emden. Plus you get 20 times restless fire camouflage. Oh, and did I mention 2.5 million credits? And wait, I'm not even done. There's more. You also get seven days of a premium account. So guys, check out World of Warships down below. And again, huge thanks to them for sponsoring this epic video. Now let's set sail in our Titanic. It was a warm August day. The year was 1912, and the Titanic had been completely constructed out of cardboard. The crew, mainly the captain, was hard at work, preparing his notes and papers, checking the weather. There wasn't a cloud in the sky, and the sea was calm as a piglet. At the back of the ship, there was hustle and bustle, as passengers began to rush into their seats and private quarters, most notably the famous Loka. The name and talk of all of London that year was one of the many passengers aboard the Titanic. Tickets! Tickets! Oh, hello there, sir! Pleasure to meet you. I see you have your ticket. Head on into your private suite. All right, everyone, the passengers are currently boarding the Titanic and we are getting ready to finally set sail on this two story massive box fort. As you guys can see, I have been hard at work in the captain's quarters, getting our entire maps and schedules all ready so that we can take off on time. We're running a little bit late here, but that is OK. We've got a amazing first day on the Titanic prepared. One of our most valuable passengers, Mr. Logan, who will be uh, joining us. He has a beautiful dinner, I believe. I believe the dinner calls for Caesar salad, flank steak, and fresh water. So that is quite a nice dinner. If we take a stroll down to my lower quarters, I was just putting out a telegram ah, on our typewriter here that I will pass on to Phil. Just need to do the final signing. And there we are. The very first telegram of the Titanic. This is the first uh, telegram of the Titanic. Philip? Yes, Captain G. Take this telegram and read it to Logan. It'll be all of tonight's itinerary along with the weather statements, everything I gave. We are about ready to set sail. I'll be beginning the final preparations. You get Logan settled into his first class room. All right, I expect a smooth ride, right, Jake? This is the most modern ship we have. Logan, the weather is very calm but dark. Sea seems to be perfect for travel. Dinner will be served at eight, sharp, Games to follow at 9 p.m. And then the captain will show you some very nice sights outside your window. And when should we be arriving at our final destination, Jake? The final destination we will be arriving at, sir, will be approximately two weeks and four days. Two weeks I gotta spend on this boat? We have many amenities such as bay blades and a lot of flank steak. No, no, Phil, Phil come on. Begin for boat submersion, Phil. I'm not spending yeah, no, no, two no, no, weeks Logan, on Logan, our Logan. pool. Logan, you gotta stay. It's captain's orders. You just get tucked right in. I'm gonna be the best host ever. 
Well, I do have my first class pod, and I guess I don't really have to do any work today, so it's nice. Just got to sit chill while they launch the boat. Da -da! Oh, da -da. Okay, Jake, I think maybe we just stop using the accents and we just, you know, be ourselves here. Logan, that is Captain Papa Jake Wilde to you, and I am using my accent because that is how they sounded back in the 1800s. Back to the floor, bowie two, four, four side. Oh, that's a big boat. That's a really big boat. Ready, three, two, one. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, hold up. Just caught on something. This might be the biggest floating box fort I have ever seen. If you think this is cool, right, smash the, the like button. <laughs> Push! And there she goes! Oh! And there she floats! The largest box for to ever set sail! And of course, remember guys, this is all a test for a two week long challenge that we want to do on a box fort in the middle of a lake. So if you guys like this video and you want to see us make an even bigger box fort and survive on a lake for a week, then smack that like button down below and leave a hashtag lake week. We're gonna take this on a lake. This thing better not sink. Oh, well, I bought like four times the size of this. It's gonna literally be the size of the lake. Come on all guys, it's time! Everyone inside! After you, Captain Jake. Thank you, sir. Mr. Logan. Oh, Thank you, Phil. Oh, whoa. Okay. And we are on board. Whoa. Oh, Jake, I haven't seen your captain's quarters. Okay, whoa, whoa. This thing is a little wobbly on the water. Not too bad, nothing to worry about. Oh, no, no, no. Jake? Yes, sir. I think I'm gonna be like seasick. Uh, that's all right, we have the things for that. Looks clear to me, Phil. We're good to put engines to 78%. Tracking sit now. Okay. Uh, I forgot to tell you, I got a little seasick. I'm literally. This is really not sturdy. It is like this is the not. Borders. This I'm isn't not good. Ready to hear any of this? Northwest, ten degrees. All right, on it. This Phil? isn't gonna be good. Phil, I'm slanted. There is a big slant in the ship. Why is the ship falling over to the right? All right, that's fine. While uh, Phil and Logan get the ship all ready, I do have some tunes. Beautiful. All right, well, everything is going as according to plan. I believe uh, Logan is being taken care of and everything in the back is under control. The ship itself is so large that it is uh, taking up a lot of the water space. It has a slight lean to the right, but I'm not going to bring that up. You know, one of the things about being a captain is you got to make sure you keep the passengers calm. We have a lot of passengers back there, including the Logan. So I don't want to go back there and be like, hey, guys, the ship's kind of tilting. That's a little weird. You know, you don't want to do that. So I'm just going to keep it chill. Chill, keep it calm. I'll keep an eye on it. So far, uh, based on my binoculars, we are, uh, yeah, we're looking good. We're looking good. Clear skies. I'll give Phil a call in a little bit and tell him to uh, arrange for dinner, but so far, so good from the captain's side of things. We'll be heading out here around this map, and basically, we'll be getting to our final destination past this island here. That's a little picture of our boat right there. Okay, so I've been chilling in my first class pod, but I'm a little bit bored, so I came out here to see what is up for entertainment on this boat. Well, you came to the right place, Logan. There's plenty of entertainment out here. Um, oh, perfect. I can sing you a song. Okay. I's the boy that builds the boat. And I's the boy that sails her. I's the boy that catches the fish and takes them home to Logan. Would you like to hear it again? I think once is good enough, but I do appreciate the song. Jake? Jake? I'm the captain. Captain? Yes, sir. Oh, Mr. Logan, I didn't see you there. Captain Papa Jake, how may I help you? Um, when you said we were going to be sailing for two weeks, I just wanted to confirm you meant like, like an hour, right? Like, no, two weeks. But don't worry, we have enough food and water to last, and there's plenty of space on the biggest boat ever created. The waves are a bit bumpy, don't mind them. It's all right, she's on autopilot, by the way, if you're wondering who's flying here. Oh! <laughs> this thing is not steady. Uh, Logan, you're in the captain. Oh! Oh, we have water! That's okay, Logan. Logan, yes, Logan, 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 please, sir. I, I would beg you to go into your cabin and take a nice nap while we sort some things out. Sorting some things out, Philip. In my cabin's quarters, please. Get Mr. Logan into his bedroom. You just get tucked in. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be fine, Mr. Logan. It's all fine. 
Jake, there's a little more turbulence than I thought there was going to be. Yes, the waves seem to be picking up. Phil, listen to me, okay? Logan is a very important passenger, and we cannot have him seeing stuff like water. You have to scrub the decks as quick as possible. Now, I'm sending you a letter because I need something. But I'm not done writing it yet. Why wouldn't you just tell me? Because it's not official, Phil. Now, please, I don't want any more seawater in my boat. Get it, my boy. Yes, Brand new note off the presses. Got it. Jake. I need to get off the boat. Uh, well, you can't get I'm off I'm going boat. to be sick. There's, uh, there's literally just water out there. Once we get out of the, I uh... I feel sick, Jake. Yeah, I fine. need to be on land. Get no, me no, off no, that, the boat. Fine. Once we get past the, uh, the, you know, the main area, that's when the, the water, like, Oh, please down. stay in your suite! Please stay in your suite, sir! Mr. 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 Sir! Mr. Sir! Mr. Mr. Logan! Mr. Logan! Mr. Logan, please. Please. Everyone. Jake! Oh! Who's driving the ship? It's on autopilot. We're all good. Jake, it's so hot in here. I need to get off. Mr. Logan, you have windows. Open them at your convenience. Philip? Yes, did you read my letter? I haven't had a chance yet. I'm trying to run a ship here, everyone, and it's very difficult. Philip, read my letter aloud. Please bring me water. Yes, I'm very hot. Mr. Logan, seasickness is nothing to be embarrassed about. Some of the most uh, prestigious men are seasick. <laughs> you, you're going to be perfectly fine. Philip, I'm going to get us a key. I'm on water. the water. I'm on the water. Okay, sing him a seasickness song. All right, guys, uh, this thing's a bit more rickety than I had anticipated. I was uh, more or less anticipating, given the size of the Titanic, that she would be uh, very solid in turbulence, but the sea is picking up a little bit, and we are definitely getting... Yes, yes! Captain Jake? Yes, Phil. Your water? Thank you, Philip. It's hard work being a captain, guys. First day is always rough. You got people having seasickness. It can be turbulent. It can be scary, but that's why I prepared, you know? I've got my compass here, letting me know we're going in the right direction, and that's all you can do. You point your ship in the right direction, and you just let her let her go, so. I need to get off this ship. Please, Mr. Logan, there is no way to get off the ship. I can assure you, there is just water out there. You would much rather be in here than in the water. to be sick. That's okay, Phil. Make him some food. Keith, it's not dinner time yet. It's not dinner time, Philip, but Logan is unwell. Mr. Logan, would you like some flank steak and or Caesar salad? I make the best steak, come on, I got you. Oh, Matilda, oh, I wish you could be here on this boat. I miss you so back in London. For those of you who don't know, this is my wife, Matilda. It's not the best photo I have of her, but it surely shows her beautiful features. Oh! Oh! Is everything all right back there? No! no Jake! What do you mean, no? The phone almost tipped. No, this boat can't tip. It's impossible. Philip, what is going on back there? Oh, wow. You got it nice up here. Look at these captain's quarters. Yes, that's because I'm, I'm in charge of the whole ship, Philip. We should see what we're working with back there. It's first class, Philip. Not where I'm staying. Okay, guys, so Logan's feeling a little unwell now that we've been on the water for a little bit. But what better time than to make him his favorite meal, steak and Caesar salad. Salad, steak. I've got my grill, and we should have this ready in no time. So I've been on the boat now. I'm not even joking. I am seasick from being on the boat, and Jake and Phil won't let me off the boat. So I'm just gonna stay here with my head on the pillow and try and not feel sick. Jake! Jake, what's going on? There is water coming in the cabin! There is a waterfall outside the boat, Philip! So steer us away! I was sleeping! Oh yeah, there is a waterfall out here. Don't let that happen again. You went to take a nap, Jake. I'm sorry, Philip. I've got steaks on the burner. Okay, make me a steak. And remember, call me for Beyblades. I don't want to miss Beyblades. Like, seriously, though, that's going to be fun. I don't, I don't want to miss that. I'm sorry, guys. I, I can't really vlog anything on the Titanic because I feel so sick. Don't worry, Logan. <laughs> Dinner is coming along splendidly. Okay, guys. So Logan's Caesar salad is looking phenomenal, if I do say so myself. And I've turned off the burners. I think the steaks are done, and it's time to serve dinner. Just like that, guys, we've got steak and Caesar salad for dinner. Thank you, Phil. I don't really have much of an appetite right now, but it does smell delicious. All right, Logan, your first class Titanic meal is served. 
Thank you very much. First bite. Oh boy, oh boy. Jake, captain. Yo, our captain's asleep. Jake. Yes. Yes. Jake, how are you steering the ship if you're asleep? It's autopilot, Logan. What's wrong? Are we, are we sinking? No, I was just saying, I think it's time for Beyblades. Oh! Indeed, it is time for Beyblades. Perfect. Before the Beyblade uh, tournament begins, I do have a letter for you to read in private. Keep this confidential from the rest of the passengers. It's nothing set up, don't worry. Now, who said Beyblades? Careful, Jake, this thing is wobbly. Yes. Well, Beyblades? All right, guys, let's see what all this commotion's about. Jake said I have to read this letter in private. It has come to my attention, the ice ahead is thicker than I had thought. Please be advised, there will be some bumpiness. I expect you to keep passengers calm. Oh no. The ship will hold. Well, that's good. But in case of danger, have a life jacket and rafts ready at all times. Captain Papa Jake. Guys, I thought this Titanic wasn't gonna sink. What did you just say? Oh, nothing, nothing. Isn't it Beyblade time? Yes. Logan, Beyblades, come on now. Uh, best pastime they used to play on the Titanic all the time. And as the captain, I'll surely win. Let rip! Oh, the battle's on! Oh, come on, buddy! Get off the wall! Oh, I destroyed you! I honestly don't know which one was I which. Want, I totally won that. I stopped yours before mine exploded. Oh, Jake, it is okay, because I feel extremely no, no, nauseous. No, it's, I'm it's just gonna... Oh, 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 Logan, Logan! Logan! What kind of ship is this? There's water aboard the ship! There's water aboard the ship! Mr. Jake, Logan, please. what kind of ship are you running? It's perfectly fine. This is obviously not get okay. Back to your quarters. Please, please, please. Back to your quarters. Back to your quarters. Get up. Get over here. We have taken on a lot of water. As per my letter that I read you, there might be Jake, some. I haven't had time to clear the board off yet. Jake, why is my quarters completely empty? My bed is gone. Yes, well, we're just making some slight adjustments to the weight so that no more water gets on the ship. The weight, the, the boat is just a little bit heavy. Oh, boy. Start cleaning the boat out. It's I'm getting trying. heavy, Phil. Ah! Ah! Keep the GoPro on. Keep the GoPro on. Get the GoPro ah! What's going on? <laughs> Everything's fine! Get back to your corners! This isn't good. This is not good. The Titanic is sinking. We have water coming in from all sides. Jake! I gotta get my jumbo! He's still down there! Oh no, 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 no! This isn't good! This isn't good! No! Logan, what's going on? No! No! Oh no, no, no! It's cold! It's freezing! We're going down! Phil! Ah! I need a life jacket! Do it there! I'm coming! Okay, we have a life jacket. Jake, where's Jake? Logan! Jake, where are you? Logan, Logan! Who built this thing? I just need to find Matilda. What? Matilda. No, Jake, it's done, man. It's done. The but Titanic. Matilda. The Titanic sunk once I'll again. I'll never leave Matilda. Who's Matilda? Phil has a life raft. Oh no. Oh no. Matilda. Oh, oh, Matilda. Remind me never to get on the Titanic with you guys ever again. It happens every time. Every time, I'm once a, a year. I'm not Matilda, but not. All right, I'm out of here. All right, guys. Well, honestly, this time it was not planned, but the Titanic once again has cursed us and it has sunk. I don't know, guys. I think every time we do this, every summer, this thing just has to sink, but every year it gets bigger and bigger. So smack that like button if you enjoyed this video. Also, do not forget, if you guys want us to survive for an entire week afloat in the middle of a lake, then hit that like button down below and put hashtag Lake Week below. Also, I want to give a huge shout out to World of Warships for sponsoring 
watching this video, do not forget to check the link in the description down below for more info on the game. And before I go anywhere, how can I forget to give the biggest shout out? And that's to today's amazing squad member. And today's shout out goes to KB Nations. If you see them down below, be sure to give them a huge thumbs up. And of course, if you guys want a shout out in one of our videos, all you have to do is hit the bell button, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and most importantly, comment hashtag SQUAD! But we'll see you guys next time for another awesome video!